All right, we got some goodies. Uh, I ordered some uh, spinal taps uh, with 110 grain inserts and a new string and air brakes. So we are going to take a shot indoors. Don't try this at home. And uh, see what the difference the air brakes make, uh, decibel wise. Uh, this is not scientific. Uh, we're also going to mount all the Tacticam uh, Solo Hunter. Uh, Reveal X, uh, this is the Gen 2. Can't wait to try this out. So, a little bit of reviews on uh, everything. So, uh, we'll pull the bow out, fire a shot into the bag, uh, spider web target. Use it to decock my bow all the time, just right, right at my feet. Uh, never had an arrow go through it. Uh, don't know what the penetration of these will be, but I guess we'll find out. So let's take a shot with my old string, no air brakes, and my old, uh, old zombie slayers. Uh, these are a lot lighter. And uh, we'll see what we get. Uh, I want to measure the difference between the, the taps and knees too. Uh, we'll get to that in a little bit. All right, let's cock the bow and take the shot. Okay, this is literally point blank range. Uh, I'm gonna fire here uh, for a decibel meter to pick it up. All right, that only says uh, max 76. Not sure. Uh, how accurate that is because it sounds a whole lot louder than 76 decibels. Boo! All right, well, we'll take the shot from the same spot. We'll reset the max. And uh, after we get everything put on, string and uh, air brakes and then we'll see what it does oh and watch how easy it is to take these arrows out it literally might have went in like that far awesome target love it Let's measure the zombie slayers. 411.2. We use the same tip. Put it on the tap. Four twenty two point six. About 11 grains heavier. I'll just leave that on there because we're going to need that. All right, let's take the string off and uh, get the work on the bow.
of pet peeve stickers that do not come off. See a twist tie or something. It's good enough. Things are nice and squishy. Put that on. A bit of a mess. Okay. Plastic washer between the air brake and the bolt. That'll go in there like so. One side done, we'll do the other side, and then we'll be back after we string. Alright, have the string installed, uh, it's definitely a little shorter than the stock string. Um, I don't even barely have a half a twist, and it's the bracelet's like way There's the brace height. That's that's about where it came, you know, when they shipped it to me, but we'll see. Alright, let's load the arrow and uh, fire it off and see what that thing says. We'll reset that. Don't know how that little bit of noise made it louder than uh, the bow. Alright, going hot. Alright. 
not sure how that could be louder but it did have a lot less uh, I'll put the two clips run them a couple times and see First time using a fire knock. Uh, I forget what they say to turn them off. I think you just tap them. Huh. All right. Nice. A little better than. Uh, Wiggling with pliers. All right. Uh, that'll be uh, it for this video. Uh, next video, we'll slide in the uh, taps and uh, I'm going to mount the uh, Tacticam and we'll see how that works uh, while we're slating it in. Hit the subscribe button and we will see you next time.